Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video I am showing you some of the tools I use for sculpting and some I haven't used yet. I hope you will enjoy this video. The Xacto knife or craft knife is an essential tool when using polymer clay to cut off bits of clay or carefully applying them. I use my Xacto knife quite a lot. Knitting needles are not only cheap tools, but they are also very useful for blending seams. They can be also used for forming ears. Tapestry needles are also cheap tools and I use these for creating fur on short-haired animals. I also use them for creating details such as whisker and nose holes and for indenting paws. I have clay shapers in various sizes, but I rarely use them with polymer clay. As you can see, it's not so easy to use a shaper with firm to medium blend polymer clay. These shapers are easier to use with softer clay and also with precious metal clay. These are basically sewing needles baked in polymer clay and they create a fine and even texture and can save you time. Let's have a look how they work. These tiny round cutters are useful for all sorts of purposes. For example, you can use them to create scales for a dragon, like this one. Or you can use them to create cheeks for very small sculptures, like this cat.
An extruder is a time saver when you want to create animals with thick fur or wool. You get evenly extruded clay in various thicknesses and can cut it to size for whatever you need it for. I use the extruder for my sheep. I also have wax carving tools. I have to admit I haven't used these yet, so this is a premiere. Let's have a look how these work. As you can see, you can create very interesting textures with these tools, so I will definitely use them in the future for my sculptures. The final tools I want to show you are these ball stylus tools in various sizes. These are useful for all sorts of purposes. You can use them to create dents for eyes, or you can create nose holes, or you can simply use these to texture the clay. They can also be used to smooth clay over. And that's it. These are the tools I have for sculpting. I find that I use the tapestry needles, ball stylus tools and knitting needles the most. And these are all cheap tools.
I hope you found this video interesting. Let me know in the comments. If you like this video, make sure to hit the like button and share it. Happy claying and thanks for watching.